introducing straight out of golf concepts sugar golf it is the sugar golf ball a compatible golf ball against the chrome soft z star and the pro v1 today what we've done is i've spent sort of roughly 30 minutes to an hour hitting golf balls getting the best stats that i could for you guys for the test we tested drivers then same scenario with a seven iron and then obviously a lob wedge hitting half a shot roughly 20 to 25 meters and then a full shot the key numbers that i'm looking for obviously is ball speed launch condition spin rate off the club face and then obviously just the, the old usual total carry total distance just to see how it's going to come out nice good feeling off the driver i'll be honest definitely a lot good soft in comparison to to some of the other brands um, you know probably one also felt soft and felt a little bit firmer but definitely good feel of the club face nice soft feeling uh, also felt like the ball came off the club face a fraction quicker um, so obviously we'll see the numbers we compare in depth blind test with no writing on it um, you know I won't I won't be able to tell the difference between the feel of the golf balls that's how good it feels compared to some of the other brands first we're going drivers you know with the four golf balls we can see obviously my club at speed was very consistent with the sugar golf ball we can see the ball speed is up compared to the other golf balls and also the consistency is a fraction better compared than the Pro V your Strixen and then obviously your Chrome Soft. The spin rate very consistent as well. We can see all of them roughly at 2.4 with very good consistencies. The Pro V had actually the best consistency out of all, but it is competing with the big boys in the market. Coming in at 260 carries, same as the Pro V1, um, with the basically the Z Star coming in third. Total distance, 290 total distance, it is the same as the Pro V, 0.4 longer. All right, so heading into the irons, same as before, I tried to get a very similar club at speed throughout the shots. So we can see the sugar was a fraction quicker, uh, not intentionally, but it was a little bit quicker than the rest of the brands, but we can see ball speed off the club face is a fraction higher. Um, if we look at smash factors, all the smash factors on the irons were pretty good, you know, at 1.42, 1.43. If we look at spin rate, it did have the highest spin rate um, on the irons compared to the rest. It's competing in the spin rate numbers there. It's really not a bad golf ball to use on the, on the irons as well. My total distance or my max out carry distance um, you know, with my irons are normally close to 170, out on the course 165, 170 is where I'm at. The Pro V came down at 169, which is sort of par for the course. The Sugar Golf Ball though was 5 meters longer in carry. If you want to save shots, you need control around the greens. And from this part, this is where the testing gets fun. I've hit a couple of full lob wedge shots and also half a shot, which I'll get into after this if you look at the stats yes the pro v1 is spinning the best it is the highest it's over 10,000 rpms the sugar golf ball has come in third position just 400 rpms below that the last test was basically a 20 to 25 meter chip shot or pitch shot so what we can see is definitely the chrome soft was performing the best out there it's like a good spin rate of 5.9 um, with the Sugar Golf Ball coming in third, you know, only 300 RPMs less than that. We can see the Sugar Golf Ball is, and I, and I know I've said it again in a lot of times, it is competing against the top of the range golf balls. The Sugar Golf Ball is out there competing from spin rate, launch condition, ball speed off the club face, which makes it a golf ball definitely to try out. But here's the amazing stat. It's gonna come in at 15 Rand cheaper compared to your average top of the range premium golf ball. 
So, if you guys are interested, please contact us at Golf Concepts and we'll direct you and help you to get sugar golf balls in your hands.